A new fallout for Jerry Falwell Jr., the Christian evangelical forced out from the presidency of Liberty University after a sex scandal. The former business partner who claimed he had an affair involving Falwell and his wife Becky is now speaking out. And we hear Becky Falwell's first response to the charges. Janae Norman has the latest. Good morning, Janae. Hey, George. Good morning. In an interview with the Washington Post, Falwell calling his former business partner a criminal and a liar. But Giancarlo Granda is standing by a story calling Falwell a predator and painting a picture of Falwell's private life that is very different from his public persona. This morning, new allegations from the business partner at the center of the Jerry Falwell Jr. sex scandal. The former president of Liberty University, the nation's largest Christian college, resigning in disgrace after a one-time Miami pool attendant, Giancarlo Granda, claimed he had a seven-year affair with Falwell's wife, Becky, and that Falwell watched when they were intimate. Falwell denies being involved in the affair. In a statement overnight, Granda standing by his story, saying the Falwells will have you believe that I seduced Becky into an affair without Jerry's knowledge and then spent the intervening seven years trying to extort them. Of course, the truth is they approached me. She invited me to their hotel room. They brought me on multiple trips and vacations, including to their family farm in Virginia. He continues to lash out at his former business partner, saying the reality is Jerry Falwell is a predator. The university was founded by Falwell's father, who famously coined the phrase moral majority and frequently drew criticism for his attacks on LGBT Americans and feminists, blaming them for the September 11th attacks. I really believe that the pagans and the abortionists and the feminists and the gays and the lesbians, all of them who tried to secularize America, I point the thing in their face and say, you helped this happen. Falwell Jr. took over following his father's death in 2007, promising to uphold the school's strict moral rules for everything from swimsuits and movies to a ban on alcoholic beverages. And this warning about relationships on campus, sexual relations outside of a biblically ordained marriage between a natural born man and a natural born woman are not permissible at Liberty University. Earlier this month, Falwell agreed to take an indefinite leave following weeks of negative headlines starting when he posted this racy photo on social media with his wife's assistant. He later took the photo down and apologized. Then this week, the bombshell affair. But according to the Washington Post, Falwell said he was leaving Liberty in part because he had been bored and wanted to move on, and he did not want his wife's conduct to embarrass the school. Becky Falwell, seen here speaking with the president's daughter-in-law about the university in 2019. We are so proud of our students here at Liberty. And it's, it's just such an honor to be able to serve alongside them. And we try to teach good family values and good morals. Now telling the Washington Post, I wish Christians and people would be as forgiving as Christ was. And Falwell's contract entitles him to a ten and a half million dollar severance package in part because he's leaving his position with the university without being formally accused of any wrongdoing or admitting to any. Cecilia. All right, Janae, thanks so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.